Well, hello there, everyone. You hear you talk about here, talk about for signatures, though, and uh, talking about uh, for the Thanksgiving holiday, but then also it sure seems that way that whenever it comes to signatures, right? And uh, what does it usually mean uh, when uh, we do uh, speak about signatures? It's basically, it's a, it's a voice, right? It's a voice that uh, you know, pretty much is to where you're, uh, you're speaking uh, you know, for something and uh, like everybody else would even say is to where that uh, whenever you're going to be uh, writing down notes and maybe taking down notes for any reason at all that you might even think is to where that, you know, yeah, whenever you first started writing about something uh, you were really just thinking about your thoughts and your your opinions about certain things, but but let's just say that if you were to be uh, getting into like maybe a group chat or something like that, you know, talking to somebody, and it's like uh, you know, yeah, that um, it, number one that, that what what you were doing was that you were just trying out different things and exploring different opportunities, you know, stuff like that. But but that this right here will be an example right here. Of like a, some source of discussion, you know, if it's going to maybe be about politics or maybe if it's going to be about maybe online shopping or something like that. But why do we think, number one, that uh, it will be the signature right here? So like anybody say that, you know, yeah, if you do, a, you know, even if it's a gift card or maybe if it's a, a billing statement or something like that, that, that uh, you would uh, see something like that to where that uh, it would say on there that, you know, yeah, well, really, that... um on it, the bill that uh, that you receive in the mail, that uh, you know, you would see something like that to where that uh, it would say that I'm like, oh yeah, you know, you would receive a a bill in the mail, but at the same time, you're thinking too is that uh, you know I'm just uh, I'm trying to put I'm like, oh yeah, like what exactly is it that you're trying to place right there, you know, for a sticker or something? But I'm like, well, really that uh, I'm trying to use the arrows, by the way, but. Uh, like everybody else might say that uh, whenever you do uh, go shopping at the store a lot of times. Thinking it's to where, well really, play ball or something like that. I'm like, that didn't really make any sense. But like er everybody else might say that, uh, you know, if you were to be uh, thinking about your name in general, that uh, why do you think that maybe, you know, maybe, I'm like everybody else might say that based on your shopping experience... That uh, you're always wearing to wear. That uh, whenever you do think about your name a lot of times, you're more likely are thinking about maybe, you know, yeah, your goals and achievements and maybe about anything else about, you know, what you do, who you are, what you do and all that. But, but a lot of times it sure seems that way that when we do speak about the voice a lot of times, that uh, we're thinking as to where, yeah, well, whenever you do... Uh, receive a billing statement or something like that and one oh two that um that yeah you know the bill of course i'm like oh yeah when we talk about it's in your name right and to talk up for the next party but uh but i'll go ahead and put right here is like it's in your name for a reason just because your uh yeah, you're using uh, the service. And uh, like everybody else might even say that, uh, you know, during a time, like anybody might even say too, that, uh, that uh, you know, there probably, there's probably a lot of reasons maybe why that, uh, you know, uh, yeah, you know, receiving a package in the mail or anything like that in 102, that uh, whenever it comes to uh, understanding about uh, signing something and whenever it comes to, understanding about the voice right and so you're probably thinking too that that number one that your name uh, really i'm like does your name really need to be spelt right on that statement so like let's just say that if you receive a ticket that for maybe for a concert ticket or something like that and 102 that maybe uh yeah like a notary or something like that or anything else uh, that is uh related to about that uh, you know text uh texting or, or something like that and I want to know too that um, that whenever we um, you know, back up whenever we were in school, a lot of times people might even say is that uh, you know your name uh, for sure. I'm like, what what exactly? Uh, you know, how was your name uh, pronounced uh, whenever you were in school those couple of times? And it sure seems that way that I went by the name of just Matt right here, M C G U I R E, and sometimes. 
You know, it was uh, sometimes my name uh, was spelt as um, with a uh, you know just a uh, just a capital M right there. So it sure seems that way that uh, that every time we think about signatures, a lot of times, and people might even say that that uh, you know, do you prefer for your name to be spelt with just uh, one uppercase M, and then uh, you got the C G U I R E right there. But it sure seems that way. That uh, why do you think that anybody would be asking me that question? So far as signatures go, is toward it. Uh, that yeah, is your uh, name right here? I'm like, uh, so let's just say that if I were to maybe write my full, uh, you know, first name right here, and let's just say that if I were to put. Uh, you know, with a capital H right there, and people might say that, um, that, hey, that, um, that right there, is that supposed to be, uh, you know, is that your username right there, and that, like, anybody say that, you know, and then uh, knowing that you can actually copy and paste that, and, you know, clip, you know, yeah, paste it into a clipboard, so it sure seems that way that every time we do think about the voice and maybe think about, uh, uh, a name and signature, that uh, it sure seems that way. That um, that uh, with uh, a lot of this uh, copy and paste uh, in, uh, tools and nowadays, that it seems like uh, you know, especially whenever it comes to politics, that uh, you're always warned to where that uh, that if everybody yet learned how to do that, and then maybe they would be uh, you know you know stamping the name on maybe uh, on sticky notes and maybe other things that the that they're going to be stamping the name on, but. A lot of times it seems like that um, that every time we do uh, think about signatures, though, uh, that it seems like that uh, people say is as to where that you would use your name on pawn an agreement, right? So, like, let's just say that anything uh, that was talked about from earlier, and let's just say that if it's maybe anything that you were trying to share or maybe selling anything or maybe uh, trying to proceed with anything, any changes made or something like that, and uh, that's why it sure seems that way that uh, people might say is that, uh, you know, really, that, uh, you know, at the beginning that a lot of people uh, would have not pronounced your name correctly. And maybe a lot of people would say is to where they, yeah, well, really, that uh, that whenever you do spell your name, that number one, that, uh, you know, you might have been at maybe a certain level of staff or something like that. So like anybody say that, yeah, you're signed in as a student or you're, yeah, you just signed in as a, as a faculty member or somebody like that. Your professor or, you know, maybe, uh, you know, uh, anybody, anybody like, yeah, or as a guest and like everybody else might say that, well, really, that, um, that you're going to maybe have that to where your account is indicating guest. And um, so let, let's just say that if you do have an account toward it, uh, you uh, were able to sign into the uh, that same account right there, but then uh, you were able to sign in as guest. And uh, so like everybody else would say is that, uh, you know, really, that why would anybody want to spend so much time trying to, uh, you know, find out, okay, what's going on? How come you're not able to sign in? And maybe, uh, you know, but, but still, that... Um, so a lot of us would even say too that uh, whenever it comes to signatures, though, uh, that uh, it seems like uh, that uh, not just the spelling of somebody's name, but then also that uh, you know, yeah, that that uh, they're able to uh, verify who you are, you know, just by toward that. Uh, okay, you know, yeah, you're signed in as guest, but we would actually uh, like for you. I'm like, oh you know, yeah, if you're trying to sign in. Uh, Please use your business account or something like that. So it sure seems that way that every time we speak about the voice, though, that you're thinking is that uh, that whenever you first learned how to use a lot of this, uh, this uh, these techniques and these methods, though, you were, you were probably thinking is that, you know, really that uh, whenever we do speak about a vo the voice, though, what you really are, you you know, most of the practices you probably have gotten it to you know, just by writing a love letter to somebody, right? Writing a letter, maybe a personal letter, or you know, maybe secrety type message or something like that. But a lot of times you're always worried oh, too that um, that whenever it comes to uh, whenever you're going to be on your tablet or maybe uh, on your desktop computer there, and one oh two that uh, that yeah, well really that. Um, 
whenever it comes to your voice and opinions, right, you're probably thinking as to where that, um, that, you know, why do you think that maybe somebody else would be interested in looking at your stuff? And uh, that's why it seems like, uh, you know, knowing about, you know, sharing your resources and maybe anybody say anybody who wants to buy your resources and all that. But a lot of times it sure seems that way that why do we maybe think is toward, yeah, well, you're, you know, your name, of course, uh, you know, your name is another source of uh, of uh, resource that, uh, and like everybody else might say that, uh, you know, do you want to look at that kind of like, like a mascot? And um, like everybody else, they say, it's not, it's not really a mascot. But it sure seems that way that, um, that you want to kind of look at that is this toward if one of these days, if we were to become famous for maybe for a song or something like that, or maybe for a book or a title or something like that, and I want to know too that, uh, you know, why do you think that uh, for any reason at all that uh, that you would want to look at your name is to where the people recognize that signature for that reason, uh, you know, maybe because, you know, you were, you were there over there at the ball game going into that one event or something like that, but... At the time, you're always one oh two that uh, you know yeah yeah number you know, a lot a lot what I do see nowadays is about you know yeah if it's paperwork or maybe if it's a document the signatures maybe for the 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 Republican Democratic Party or something like that but it sure seems that way that uh, most of my practice actually came from greeting cards and I'll even tell everybody here that uh, most of uh, of the skills that I really have studied about came from the greeting cards yeah the greeting cards and I'm sure yeah the greeting cards the hallmark hallmark cards like the hallmark of greeting cards and uh, so it sure seems that way that um, you're probably thinking is uh, okay yeah that um, when it, the, a lot of things that you've seen in those those greeting cards were like as as somebody like if it was a baby shower or maybe a special occasion somebody get married or something like that, but nowadays it seems like that if you're trying to invite anybody to come to an event though, it's like you can actually send somebody a greeting card online and uh, the things for what you can do. But uh, it's like yeah, well really that um, the, the things that you can do. Uh, on an electronic greeting card, like we all know, uh, you know, holds a lot more information than compared to those paper cards, because we're only talking about maybe only about uh, you know how much we're talking about, only about maybe this much of a percent would uh, would be would able be visible on a national greeting card. So it sure seems that way, like everybody else may say, is to where if you try that to where it about this much you know, that would be able to be read. Uh, from a greeting card, right? You know, and if you want to maybe include like maybe 25, maybe 30 uh, sentences on, on a greeting card, like such as congratulations, you know, uh, something like, uh, you know, get, you know, you know, take care or be well or something like, or something like that. Or if it's a, maybe if you are trying to send somebody a birthday card or something like that, and a 102 that, uh, that, hey, that, uh, Whenever it comes to sending somebody a card, a lot of times, and a year warrant or that uh, that a lot of things that, that you see now on a lot of those greeting cards is to where that yeah, well, really that um, yeah, you know, if it's uh, really you know, like like everybody else might say that you know there are certain tools and techniques that you can use, just know about who sent that gift and maybe who signed that card, so. A lot of times it seems like that, that every time we think about our name in general and uh, 102 that uh, that whenever it comes to signatures though that uh, you're wondering toward it yeah well really that um, one thing that we can really pay attention to is about how somebody signs your name right and uh, you're warned toward okay yeah that according to on your side you might see something like uh you know, uh, maybe I'm like, yeah, the guest name, or maybe if you go by another name or something like that. But let, let's just say that you know, yeah, if it's uh, you know, Mad, you know, I, I don't use that name a jump, but let's just say if it's Madaru or something like that. 
yeah, Matt, Matt or Rue or something like that. I can I can maybe say something like that. You know, I have an uppercase M and then an A, a T T A R E a W, and then put on here dot and then uh, have my my middle name like that. And so it's like um, Matt or Rue and um, and if I were to, I'm like yeah yeah a certain character or something like that. So let's just say if that were right there was supposed to be. Uh, my uh, username right there, and people thinking as toward it, yeah, Madaru right there, <laughs> Madaru S right there, and uh, want to know that uh, that yeah that you know that right there is uh, what shows up uh, on it uh, on the person I'm like yeah yeah. So if you're inviting somebody into uh, a meeting, then then uh, for sure that uh, they say that in order to be able to. Uh, in order to be able to uh, receive the invite, and like everybody else might say that, um, so that's why it sure seems that way that, um, you know, every time we think about that in one o that, uh, hey, signatures, that, uh, that yeah, that uh, every time you do think about that in one o that, um, that, you know, yeah, well, really, that, um, you know, are you uh, like uh, like everybody else would say this to well, well, really, as long as it works, n number one, you know, if, if it does wind up working and let's just say that somebody's really on there, you know, yeah, they're signed in as guest or something. But but half the time, you're 102. That means uh, that, uh, you know, upon any agreement that uh, you, uh, you know, the voice is then, uh, you know, shared to the next party. So whenever you were talking about that, and let's just say if you were showing somebody how something works, and then for sure it's going to be passed on to the next person, and uh, for sure they're going to say that, yeah, well, it seems like it's all about getting the hang of it, right? <laughs> it's all about getting the, the idea about, you know, what is it, what, you know, what's, a, what's available to work with and all that. So at the time it's like, yeah, well, you know, you pass it around and, but at the same time that, that you're Warren O2, that, um, that whenever we do we think about a signature, though, that, that you do uh, really want to think about is, is that, that to where people uh, know, uh, yeah, people recognize, you know, who you are whenever you are, whenever your online says is showing that you're online. And uh, that's why it seems like that, like everybody else would say, is to where that you get the idea just because of the fact that, uh, you know, yeah, you know, people recognize your work or something like that, or but you know, but still, why well, why do we need to think about that though? To every time, you know, yeah, once you do uh, get a bill or when, once you do receive anything in your name, and uh, you're always warned to where that uh, <laughs> that yeah, that um, what's your signature? Your your signature, of course, is like what you call the most important topic about getting the job done rather than, uh, you know, yeah, whenever it comes to filling out an application, right? So a lot of times it sure seems that way that you're always wondering to where that uh, besides, you know, uh, you know, besides taking care of, uh, like, yeah, putting something in the mail, but like we all probably thinking too is like to where I talk about a signature that, uh, you know, your signature, of course, would be another important you know, I'm like, so, so, yeah, so that's maybe one of the reasons why, like everybody else might say, is that, uh, you know, to the party, or that the party would say that, um, the party said, uh, your signature is missing. And, uh, that is why it seems like, uh, that, um, when we do talk about signatures, though, that it seems like a lot of times that, uh, that yeah, well, really, that, um, that whenever it comes to taking care of something important and you're wondering to where that, you know, really, that uh, whenever it does come to getting the job done, that, that those who qualify and all that, but you're always wanting to know, too, that, uh, you know, is your name spelled correctly according to those documents? You know, the first and last name and maybe middle, you know, your initial or something like that. But we're always warned to where that uh, whenever you do participate in a lot of those meetings, that it seems like that, uh, 
you know, you're always warned toward it. You know, you don't have your ticket on hand. Like, like, like let's just say that in case if anybody were to say that uh, if you're going to be going to an event and let's just say that if you don't have your pass or your ticket uh, on, you know, available and they might even tell you that, uh, well, really, it's important that, uh, you know, that you are present too. And uh, so that's why it seems like that every time we do think about that in 102 that, uh, yeah, well, Whenever you do uh, fill out an application, like everybody else would even say that, uh, you know, you're waiting to where that moment to where, okay, is it in my name or if it's not in my name? Because if it's not in my name, for sure, then maybe you can maybe give that application to somebody else and claim it, you know, to be you're theirs to you know, to fill out or something like that. So a lot of times it seems like that to where that whenever we do talk about signatures a lot of times and you're warned to where, hey, that... um. If uh, that, uh, of course, like anybody say, is to where that uh, until it's uh, like anybody saying until that those papers are signed to the person you know who's filling out the paperwork or something like that. But a lot of times you're always warned to where that uh, you know yeah that um, you know for how important uh, you know for a signature and also about the voice because we all know. That uh, a voice is not just like everybody else would say. It's just to where that whenever we do speak about signatures. Whenever you write something down that maybe not everybody can see or everybody can hear that. So that's why it seems like that, uh, you know, people are going to be looking at these discussions right here. And always wondering to where that, okay, yeah, well, by the time somebody does get the, the, the basic idea of what you were talking about. For sure, then and uh, they're going to say is as to where the yeah, well, your signature is going to be needed, uh, you know, just to be able to take care of this next step, and um, you know, just to for you know, just to be able to get the job done, or just for some certain decisions, you know, for jobs or something like that, yeah, something just for something to be approved or something like that, and um, that's why it seems like that to where that uh, yeah, you know, talk about for your signature, right, but. But a lot of times, like everybody else may say, is to where that, you know, whenever you are signed in, you're signed in as guest, right? <laughs> but anyway, but talk about, you know, for the signatures right here. But most of the time, it's most signatures. Signatures are more.